Hi, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the LSU versus Texas A&M college football matchup on Saturday, November 25th, 2023. It's my favorite day of the week during my favorite time of the year. It's college football Saturday. Of course, I give out tons of free picks every single day, but there are some games that I like the best. Those are the ones I'm betting, and I put those under the premium picks tab at PickDogs that's your thing, 15% off if you use the discount code PICK. We also have the Dime Club and Sharp Trading Plays, and those are meant for people who make big bets. They're not available on the website. The only way to get those is to text the number that you see on the screen. So if you make big bets, text that number. But let's get to this one. LSU taking on Texas A&M. LSU, uh, eight and three on the season. Texas A&M, seven and four on the year. Of course, Jimbo Fisher, let go by Texas A&M, and that was a massive contract. We've talked about that contract a lot over the years, and I think these giant contracts, guaranteed money that we're seeing for these college coaches, oh man, it's going to be tough to uh, really justify these things in the future because that payout that goes to Jimbo Fisher, all that money was guaranteed. They owe him $70 million. Man, what are we doing wrong, right? Meanwhile, on the other side of this one, LSU, basically a typical Brian Kelly team. A whole lot of offense, a marshmallow defense, and if they can't just flat out outscore you, well, they're going to lose. And that's what we saw in the, against the better teams, like when they played against Alabama and Ole Miss and, you know, in Florida State, right? So, you know, we know that, you know, they get into these track, their idea is to get into these track meet style games. If you have a decent team and can go with them like Missouri did while you're in a competitive game, they covered the spread against Missouri, but actually it was a pick six at the end of the game, which gave LSU the cover in that game as Missouri was, it was nip and tuck the entire way. And Missouri was deep in their own end, really tried to force it. And LSU ended up running it back in for a touchdown in that one to get the cover such as life as a uh, professional sports better but anyways the thing is is that when we look at you know LSU overall the offense has been amazing Daniel's now one of the top Heisman candidates coming into this game but that sieve of a defense is certainly going to play a big part in this particular game because with Bobby Petrino running the offense man he's going to find holes in your defense that is what he's done he's made a career out of it we look at this Aggies defense it's actually better than than uh you know it's it's actually one of the better defenses in the country and it is somewhat of a mismatch when you compare that because the A&M offense isn't really that much worse than LSU's but the defense is so much better. So, you know, while Brian Kelly gets a lot of accolades, you know, over the years for his great offenses, oh man, you know, he never really beats the, beats the good teams. The thing about this series that we need to remember, though, is that it's always high scoring to begin with because... You know, the, the, the overtime rule where you have to, where it all comes down to a two point conversion versus two point conversion came out of this series that had seven overtimes one time. Um, I think that, uh, you know, just a few years ago, I think this is going to be one of those nip and tuck type games. And I think getting this bundle of points with Texas AM, way too good to pass up. I'm going to take the Aggies, and that's going to be my free pick. Of course, while you're doing your picks today, putting your bets in, use our free betting tools at Sports Chat Place. They're 100% free. They're going to tell you how often historically all the bets on the board today have hit. Pair it with today's odds, putting you on the most favorable bets on the board today.